Today, the Supreme Court handed down a decision on four of the provisions of SB 1070, uh, preempting uh, three, uh, of three, five, and six from, from actually moving forward. The worst of the four, 2B, uh, has, has still, is still to be resolved, I think. I think the, the Supreme Court left the door open for the following uh, lawsuit, the, the local community lawsuit against the state of Arizona, to really rule uh, on the racial profiling aspects of 2B. I, I think we can say that we can declare a victory on three of the four, uh, the three of the four provisions. To be uh, is yet unknown. I do think that the community needs to be vigilant. Uh, the community needs to understand that racial profiling could still be an issue, especially with uh, with energetic law enforcement officers that will take license into their own hands about uh, pursuing to be. But that's why we have a, a hotline for people to call on all the abuses to protect their rights, to know what their rights are. The the phone, the hotline number is 1-855-RESPETO, 1-855-737-7386. And there is a, a hotline being manned by Lydia Guzman and, and, her, and her organization at ACLU that will have lawyers at the other end to document stories of abuse. And I think secondly, what uh, Promise Arizona has been doing, especially out of the, the state vigil, that we have, we believe in the power of prayer, we believe that uh, we are getting prayers answered, but more importantly that our faith and action is really moving into the community, coming together, organizing, and really providing leadership for this state. And we are encouraging everyone that is eligible, especially Latinos who are eligible to vote, to register to vote, get on the early voting. Uh, mailing list and make sure that they vote in both the primaries uh, August 28th and in the general election on November 6th. It's the most important thing we can do is take ownership and responsibility for SB 1070. It would not have happened if we had a different legislature, a legislature that represents our values, the values of, of family and, and God and country, and more importantly that we're here so that everyone has a prosperous life and can live in dignity and in justice. So again, register to vote. Uh, join us at Promise Arizona. You can go to our website, www.promiseaz.org. And today was the very first step in a different new Arizona.